Maybe I just picked the wrong question. Man, he gets only three times in his life. It's teeth. Oh, 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 yeah, that's not too hard, is it? You lose. Goodbye, Steven. What? Just run past it. Egg! Egg! I've tried all of the answers! Maybe I can get it to, like, screw up twice. Making me redo all of this every time is really annoying. I wasn't confused by either of these ones. Okay, this one it flipped out about. Some couch peeps out of a corner. Okay, that's three broken ones in a row. It has to let me through. I hate that sometimes you have to click. Central processors are shutting down! The code is wrong. Alright, get the brain egg. You okay, Alex? Got some hips on you, Alex. Um, hopefully you don't die because I turned off the thing. We're just gonna... <laughs> we're just gonna hope you're okay. okay so, uh, that was really confusing by the... Oh, no. <laughs> Not with the codes. Oh, what? No, no, no. Hold up, I gotta screenshot this. Can I make this game... <gasps> you can. Oh, I should have done... That, that should always be the first thing I do, is make a game into, um... Who's he wants it? Um... Winder, borderless windowed mode. I understand completely. Wait, oh wait! Gratovig.com through abandoned refuge secrets. Okay. I, 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 almost, I almost fell for your jape. I almost fell for your jape. Alright. Uh, Gratovig.com slash through abandoned three secrets. Wait, what? Did I misspell something? Tofik. I, uh, I think that URL has been eaten by bad people. Tofik.com. Fuck. Let me look on archive.org. Websites are cheap to maintain. You sh should be able to at least keep this stuff up. Come on. This game only released like a year or two ago, I thought. I hope they're doing all right if that website, unless I... I apologize, our search engine. Oh, come on! I'm, I'm in the middle of a video. You can't be having problems. Uh, our search engines, I've never seen that before. I've never seen that on archive.com before. Oh my god. There's something that hates me, like, trying to find the secrets in this game. I just can't. This is probably the ending. Someone, yeah, this is the ending. Can't put your hair cruise off. What? If anyone knows what the secret was, please post in the comments, I guess. There was a website from uh, the, 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 the second game that I couldn't get to either. If I figure out all the extra stuff, I will um, do an extra video to be continued. So there might be more in the series, I guess. It does, that does seem like a little bit of a uh, cliffhanger to say the least. I was expecting a little more than that, but uh, that's through Abandoned 3. I feel like we must have missed a secret. We didn't we didn't get any little extra blurbs from brother. Hmm. It, was, it was a little anticlimactic of an ending, especially with the website not working. I don't know what the deal is with that. It's 
stupid archive.org not working either? I've never had that happen. This is this is not my day. I I, I don't know what's happening at all. Um, it just ends on. That can't be it. Hold on. It just ends on. Wait, I found four out of four secrets. No way. I found four out of four secrets according to the Steam achievements. The Steam achievements only pop up after you close the game, by the way. It's really confusing. I guess it doesn't want you to... Oh, I've unlocked all achievements, in fact. I guess it just doesn't want you to... Um... Wait, these are the... Wait. Oh, th those are the secrets that we found. I guess it's just this. Let me make sure here. HTTP dot... Crew, Tov. Wait, oh, I think I did a typo. Crew, Tov. Refuge. Yeah, I keep going to this privacy listing it automatically served by a third party. What? Yeah, it's just a... Yeah, it's just a placeholder site. Um... <laughs> what a mess. Just put the secret in the game. Tovic.com, okay. To abandon for future secrets. Way back machine. Oh wait, I made a typo. Please. <gasps> Snapshots. This might be it. I'm sorry for the beeswax. All right, here we go, here we go. The refuge. Hi, I'm Igor Krutov, creator of the Through Abandoned series. You're here because you found four to four secrets in Through Abandoned 3. The refuge means you're smart, and I hope you appreciate my games. Please welcome my place in the web. Well, I, I, I wish your website was still up, but... As a small bonus for your smartness, I will show you which references I use creating TA3. There are some works of art, books, movies. I can guess which movies I like and which inspire me. I also explain some parts of the Through Abandoned Universe. The Refuge Corridor, the round doors which lead out of the Refuge, were inspired by the amazing TV Stargate. Not, not a surprise. Um, military team discovered the net of such gates and traveled around the whole universe. That does, yeah, that does definitely sound related to the connections. By the way, we have access to only one floor of the Refuge Corridors with the round doors. So these are different gates in the ordered. One floor of refuge for one world. Gates from one corridor where you start TA3 is the Earth Hub. The language. If you press the side of the gates, you see a hologram. It's an address in the engineer's language. You've seen such symbols before. They have a sense. I've developed a language of engineers. You can try to decrypt it. Some words or at least a system. The code's on the wires. One of my favorite puzzles is Safecracker. <laughs> the idea of the code which is drawn by wires is attributed with respect to this game. If you like such games, do not miss it. Yeah, that's... Lots of games like that kind of thing. Um, the elevator. The refuge doesn't exist in only one world. Unfortunately, there's images um, that seem to have not been captured. Does anyone know why that happens? Because some images on mine, it hotlinks them. And the problem with that is that if my site went completely down, the hotlinked images would not be saved. And I want my site to be totally preserved. Um, I, I'm, I care a lot about preservation stuff. I think I talked about the beginning of this or the first game. Um, so I, I do care a lot about preservation, so... I, I really do hope that's a thing. Um, but, uh, yeah, I don't know how many of you preserve your own websites and stuff, but uh, it would be good to know. Um, it didn't help that the refuge was destroyed and people died. Or, the refuge doesn't exist in only one world. It's situated in different place, pieces of ordered, very good hidden places, under the ground of hell-type planets, inside so young solar systems near black holes. But it didn't help and the refuge was destroyed and people died. There's only a thousand people in the refuge, though? Or no, 10,000, but still. Uh, the elevator is the special system which teleports you to different parts of the refuge. Each part has coordinates, but the panel is broken. You can only use the favorite floor's buttons. Uh, 
those are some weird favorite floors, by the way. Um, you're in this very subway in the underground city. I knew it! I knew it! It's the strange world the USSR and the USA are the same country. See? I, I pointed that out. So you can see Cyrillic words in the subway. When you go through the second door, you turn up and say it looks like New York. And you see English signboards. Read the name of the station entrance youth and the subway you see... Uh, Name of the station. Odoi Sedanya. Uh, I can translate it as youth. I must admit the mood of the abandoned subway was also uh, inspired by the brilliant novels of Dmitry Bukovsky, Metro 2033, about the life in the Metro subway after nuclear war. Yeah, something about Russian subways is definitely a big aesthetic. Um, how is it possible to enter this very subway from the underground city? I don't know. The thing is, the subway leads to different worlds with open teleports. Maybe it was the experiment and such portals could replace doors. But engineers disappeared, and we'll never find this out. The secret in the subway. Can you recognize that place? Yes, I did! It's the concrete well from through abandoned one. When you played the chapter, you couldn't get there because of the water. Now the well is dried, and you can go down and activate the secret sign. I do love such things in games. That is neat, the callbacks and stuff. Uh, the temple. I'm so glad that archive.org captured this, because, yeah, the site does seem to be down now. Um, at least... Oh, maybe I just made a typo. Let's see here. No, no, it's it's just a, yeah, one of those. We we stole this website, or you know, we, you know, it, it got leased back to the company. It sucks. Um, there's gonna be an explicit provision in my will that's sirtapdap.com and any other websites I manage. Those are gonna stay up forever. You know, it's like, it's like ten bucks a year for a domain name and like five bucks a month for a Linode instance, like. Come on, you can keep that crap going indefinitely if it really matters to you. Uh, anyway, uh, the refuge core. Wait. Um, oh no, we're not. Where were where we? Tower, the temple, secret in the subway. Oh, here we go. There's a lot of secrets in this. I was like getting upset. I was like, oh man, there's no secrets this time. But I'm so glad. I'm so glad that I figured that I, you know, got the uh, archive working. Um, so, sorry about the clumsiness of all of this, but, uh, we, we got it. We did it, read it. The church is hidden between worlds. Looks like there's some dark and scary cults in the Ordered. People worship some powerful and angry beings. That's kind of what I figured. Those weird, dark creatures. Uh, this lo location is inspired by Necromonger style from the movie Chronicles of Riddick. Also took a little bit of Giger as alien style. Uh, th there was another thing that was a bit more Giger-esque, but, uh... Interesting question is, who's the guy in the prison under the temple who wrote the coordinates at the core? Why was he there? Small hub with six doors. Looks like somebody lived there. Someone who decided who could pass and who could not. There's such a tower in the novel, the great modern rusher. Sergei, I think you mentioned that. Or no? He definitely talked about a different book, maybe. Works as customs between worlds. The tower and through abandoned doesn't have any exit. You can watch the local world through the windows, but you can never go out. Aw. The way. The way is the world parallel to our Earth, but already abandoned. The place that you see it is in Spain. It's located in St. James Way, the most popular pilgrim route in the world. People come on foot from different parts of Europe through Spain to see the remains of St. James' body in Santiago de Campolista. Com Compostela. I don't speak Spanish. Uh, once I completed this pilgrimage by bicycle, it inspired me a lot. And through abandoned universe, the way is a much more important sacred meaning. It passes through space. You can see the hologram of the way in space, in the observatory. Huh. I didn't know that. I love little things like this to talk about all of their inspirations and stuff. I'm so glad this was included. This is great. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Wait. Can't get the image. Um, the house. It's the classical place with ghosts. Old and creepy. Try to find a couple of small references in this location. Do you like the... <laughs> I'm sure the American Gothic was one of them. Do you like the... Uh, piano puzzle? I'm a musician. <laughs> no, no, I didn't. But I can tell that you're a musician because you thought it was easy. Um, a guitar player and a singer, so it's not so easy to design a musical puzzle for non-musicians. Um, who was the guy in the painted stained glass window? And whose diary in the bedroom on the second floor? Hmm, maybe it's not the last time you see this place. So it does seem like there's supposed to be a through abandoned four. I don't know if... Um, let's... When did this come out? <laughs> that's That's me! Hi, me. Uh, when did this come out? Mixed? Really? I mean, the, there is the... I will say the ending did... I was kind of annoyed by that, but... Um, 
I still enjoyed it a lot. I think the other ones, the reviews are kind of mixed. I mean, it's a short little game. Um, puzzles can be a little frustrating. But I like this a lot. It came out March, uh, you know, about a year ago. Um, so hopefully we continue to see more. I, I'm a little concerned about the website. Oh, by the way, embarrassing story. I got sent this game. Uh, I got sent through Abandoned 2 um, in 2016. And I just checked it out um, in early 2020. Uh, that's, that just tends to be me. I, um, I have a system here on Steam where I had been, um, I install all of this stuff that I get to review and stuff, and it really, really got away from me. Um, so now what I do is I try to install something if I want to check it out, I delete it off my system if I don't, um, if I don't want to check it out anymore or if I have played it. So I'm trying to be much more aggressive and like keeping up on stuff. Anyway, um, the wrecked ship. This place is dedicated to my favorite game ever, Tomb Raider 2. There are some levels on the wrecked ship Maria Doria in that game. The ship, which was real by the way, lies in the deep bottom of the ocean. Only sharks can reach it. And of course you can, through doors. The gravitation anomalies are referenced to Stalker by the Strugatsky brothers. There's an anomaly called Meat Grinder, and I read the book. I always imagined it in such a way. Is that, is that what the Stalker games are based on? Shadow of Chernobyl? I played that game, but um, I played a little of that game. I didn't get very far. The, the survival mechanics, the I don't enjoy that kind of stuff. But it does sound like it's a good game. There's like some patches. There's some fan patches that make the game much better, I've heard. I should try it with those. Uh, the core. When you found the corridor from New York, you get to the elevator shaft. There are hundreds of locations and doors there. You can imagine the size of the refuge, but Lilith has closed all the doors. You can only come directly inside to her, inside a trap. The core has a lot of references. People batteries come from Matrix. Portal Machine is a reference a reference to Monsters, Inc. The Sphere Room comes from X-Men. Oh yeah, yeah, kinda. And Lilith is a big reference to my favorite character from Stephen King's book, The Train... Blaine the Mono from Wastelands, the insane AI. It's a classic. It's my respect to Master King, all this dialogue. Don't judge me too hard for that. Yeah. The insane AI is a bit of a classic, even if I'm not a big fan myself. Well, the story isn't ended. In the next parts, you'll know what kills everything in the abandoned world, what built all this. Meet survivors, maybe. Through Abandoned 4, the temple will see the light in 2019. Mm, not quite. But soon, hopefully. Take care of yourselves and comment here. I will read an answer. One more thing. Don't forget to watch details. Some interesting thing is hidden in the game that I told you. Is the game out yet? <laughs> How did people find this when the game wasn't out yet? Not. How did you find this page? <laughs> Cracks me up. Um, let's just take a quick peek on the website. So I guess we did find all the secrets. Though, though, when I was looking at the guide, um, Dogs in Space 3. Abandoned 8. What do you mean abandoned 8? Uh, this is just the app store release. Um, I, there was a video. Bo, bo, bo. There was. Um, oh crap, I must have closed it. Um, there was a video that looks like there was a couple of puzzles that got. Well, at least one puzzle that got removed from the game. Um, this is through. What the? I didn't watch that. Uh. Yeah, back to Susie's Great Escapes. Um, there was this really early on puzzle that looked really frustrating. Well, not really, but um, when you put on this panel, let me show you here. Get some music finally here. I'm get, I, I hate playing having a video with no music going on. Um, yeah, there was a puzzle here. This must have been removed in the Steam release or something. Yeah, that must have been a bit too much, which that early on, I... That probably would have been a little annoying, but I did also notice something else. Um, yeah, this. I, I didn't see this. Oh! I did not think to do that. This does look like X-Men. Um, uh, where was that? Oh yeah, it was the sea door. Let's read this message from Dear Brother, who left his thing as an egg. I was just wondering, like, we haven't heard from Dear Brother. But yeah, this should be the last secret. The last thing in the game, really. 
My brother, I'm leaving this note for you on paper because something blocks my messages in the net. I don't know what happened to the refuge, but I am sure that nobody survived here. I reached the monitoring room and checked the bio biometrical scanners. It's empty. There's so much I want to tell you, but I have no time. The track leads to the temple, the place where we can find the answers about the abandoned, I suppose. Found some refugee map. Refuge map. I know the entrance to the temple is somewhere in the core of the western part of the refuge. Let's meet there. You have to reach the elevator shaft and find the core. It's a small temple location you can find someone who knows the coordinates of it. I can't write it down. P.S. I found a fragment of some diary. The guy who wrote it is from the forest world. The last page mentioned the AI which controls the refuge. It's called the Defender. The guy who wrote the Defender had gone crazy. <laughs> Maybe it's the reason of the tragedy? Anyway, be careful. A little late for that, bro. What did this nut do? There was no point to this nut. We never used it. We never used the nut. I even I noticed the um the guide the that that guide video doesn't it doesn't even have the nut. I guess it's just pointless. But yeah, that's through abandoned three the forest by the way or the the, the refuge. By the way, I'm so glad that when you exit from the to be continued screen, you're just back at the thing and you don't have to fully restart the game. I hate when games do that. Like, I want to explore the world again. Like, let me choose when to restart. Anyway, that was through Abandoned 3. That was... I really like that. I'm surprised the Steam... The Steam stuff seems a little harsh. Mixed reviews is... Usually it takes a really bad game to get that, but... Um, I mean, it did crash a lot. That, 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 that was frustrating. But, um... Really excited to see 4. I really hope 4 is still coming. I'm concerned about the website being down. But I don't know what is up with that. Maybe he just moved and didn't, you know, didn't keep the old address. Um, I'll ask. I'll, I'll, I'll be sending him my videos once I publish the first one. I actually recorded all of these before I published the first one, just in case there was some reason to, you know, need to do that. But, um, yeah, I, I hope everything is still in business. I guess I'll leave a comment on uh, this video if they're not. But uh, I still very much look forward to number four. And it seems like it was reasonably popular. Let me see how many views were on that uh, guide. Yeah, three, well, 3,000 views. But, um... I like when you watch, like, three videos of a person and YouTube is just like, oh, you only want this, right? It's like, at least give me some recommendations. Like, I like Joel, but come on. At least give me some recommendations to what I'm currently watching. I've heard that people don't get recommendations for more of my videos when watching stuff. It's only only popular people get that treatment. What what a story, Mark. But anyway. That was through Abandon 3. I think I've said that like four times. Have a good day. And let me know what you thought of the game in the comments. I'm I'm curious if I'm like, you know, if other people thought it was like eh. Or, or what the deal is with those mixed reviews. I guess I'll go and read them after this video and make myself angry. <laughs> but, uh, see ya. Alright gamers, remember to like, subscribe, and smash that bell! Frog, what are you doing in my house? I, I, I would just get out!